my channel this is Capri spilling the tea and I came back to tell you guys the difference between a job and a career okay so I was sitting down at my desk today because my supervisor pissed me off like she always do we have like a love-hate relationship and I was sitting there thinking to myself oh my god I'm taking all these calls and you know I get up to look around and it's like nobody in the building and I'm like where is everybody so my coworker, she tells me you know everybody's quitting you know what I'm saying they're quitting and they're only coming to this job or coming to work sometimes just to get some money but most of you know most people are in school trying to get to their career job right I'm sorry I'm parched so I'm thinking to myself you know what that is so true because I docked my hours I went from 40 hours to 30 hours I cut like 10 off you know because I'm just like overwhelmed with the calls the calls are back to back it's crazy okay so anyways the difference between a job and a career so I went online today at work okay and I looked up what is the difference between having a job and a career job okay now I'm just looking on my computer right here because I saved it but a job can be just going to work to earn a simple paycheck and it says it right here online a simple paycheck so that right there tells you that a job is just a simple job that you go to just to get a paycheck there's no interest in it there's no love nothing you just going to get your money okay get your shmoneys and that's it and just go okay so that's a job okay the difference between a job and a career also is your attitude, right? Your attitude that you have towards the job or the career that you're in. Okay, so example me. I go to my job every day ready to run back to the car, ready to burst into tears. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. Okay, <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's not that bad. But some people do. Some people get to the job and their head hurts, their neck hurts. Everything on their body is just killing them when they get to the job because they don't want to be there, okay? And their attitude towards the job sucks. You know, their attitude towards the customers sucks. They're just like, thank you for contacting blah, blah, blah. How may I help you? You know, like, what the fuck you want, okay? That's how it's set up after a point of just being on a job, earning a simple paycheck, you don't wanna do it no more. You're just done. You're just like, you know what? I'm just here for the shmoneys. That's it, you know? Now, a career job, of course, with a career job, you're gonna love it, you know? Cause this is what you went to school for. You probably went to school four or five years, probably eight years if you're a doctor, just to get to this point in your life. So of course, whatever job you're working, you're gonna be happy you're gonna whether it's mcdonald's no i can't say mcdonald's no that, that that's the job okay so let's say you're working at a doctor's office okay and you went to school for like i'm gonna say four years to get there and a customer walks in with a snobby attitude you like and have a wonderful day of course because you're still getting paid you're still getting good money you went to school for it now every day may not be like that but within that time that you're there you're like hmm, this is my career job i love it i get up at a good hour you ain't worrying about them customers you don't care how they feel why because this is where you worked up to be this is where you want to be so you just like mm, they mad i'm mad i'm good good job whatever okay so that's another difference between a job and a career job the attitude okay also, it says people who want a career are always thinking about their long-term goals. They are thinking about what they can do now to make their goals happen in the future. It goes back to say you went to school for it. This is what you want to do. Like, okay, example. Let's say that you're getting out of high school and you know that, okay, when you get out of high school, you're like 18, 17, 18. Now, let's say you plan your long-term goal to get married and have kids between 30 and 35. So you're gonna take that 10 year gap 
and you're going to go to school. You're going to go to school because you're, you want to be home with your child. So you want to work up enough hours and get to where you want to be or need to be. So once you get married, you can go on your uh, honeymoon and don't have to worry about scavenging to put in time or if you're going to get paid for it you'll have that all together so you have your pto down pack which is paid time off for people who don't know what pto are is you have your vacation time together you have all this time so the setup for your future so if you get married or if you have a child you have all this time okay so that's people that want a career job to just get out of just working just a regular old job okay and another thing with a job, with a job, you'll see a lot of people just walk off. They'll just go. With a career job, it's different because you invested so much of your time. You invested all your time, which is school, going to school, nights that you had to stay up doing papers. You invested so much of that time. You're like, I'm not just going to walk off my job. Plus, I make decent money or good money. That's that's the difference. That weighs the difference. Because, hell, I know if I'm on a career job and I invested this much time, I'm not just going to walk the fuck off. No, I'm not. Okay? I'm going to take my ass in the corner, take a deep breath, count to five, and come back and... Even if I got to fake it. Okay? So, that's the difference between a job and a career job. With a job, you just like, you know what? Y'all don't even pay me enough. <laughs> Deuces. Hmm. They got me messed up. You know what I'm saying? Like, that that right there is the difference. I'm, I'm saying, I see people do it every single day at my job, okay? They're just like, these customers get on my nerves, ACW, calls ain't coming in, boop, I don't want to talk to them. They take the headset off. They're like, whatever, I don't care if I get fired, I'm going on unemployment. Because another thing with the job when you get on unemployment, you're practically making the same thing that you're making on that job. You probably make a little less, but you're not making a lot of money on just a regular job. So if you get, uh, what's the word I'm look, looking for? If you get, um, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? I just said it. <laughs> unemployment. There you go. If you get unemployment, it doesn't matter because you're just making like a step down from unemployment anyway. But if you're on a career job, unemployment, please, okay? You'll be suffering, okay? So, I just wanted to come on here and let you guys know the difference between a job and a career job. And just to try to enlighten whoever's looking at my channel, like, get into your career job if you can, okay? Get into a career job, find your niche, uh, find your passion, and do it you'll be a lot more happier skin will be flawless you won't have to worry about I'm not gonna say you don't have to worry about being upset because hell even on a damn job that that just comes along with life in a territory but at least you will get paid damn it okay good money to be upset you ain't got to worry about being upset for a little bit of goddamn money okay but all I'm saying is if you can get into your career job, do not work a job, just a simple job for a long time. It will stress you the hell out, okay? Get into your career job, find your niche, find your passion, and just do it. I wish I did a long time ago, but I was just jumping. I didn't know what my niche was. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I went to school to be a nurse just because it was the quickest thing. Everybody was going to school to be a nurse. Here go me. Well, I'm going to go to school, you know what I'm saying, to be a nurse. I should not have done that. I always wanted to be a teacher since I was younger, but life got in the way, and I just transitioned. Now I'm transitioning back. So it's not going to take long. It's only like four years. I'm still young, so I'm good. Plus, I'm 